watch this. Pot of pop of rice. I'ma live my life, Miami bike fell false. I'ma sip lean. You gon' tattle tail while I slide down here with the Alright guys, uh, this is Jeff from uh, uh, shit, Junkyard de Mongold. This is my 2014 Ford Focus SE. Today we're going to talk about uh, how to be a badass when you can't afford the ST. So, I've already got the muffler cut off this bad unit because you don't need those. It's not loud enough. So we're going to cut the first or secondary muffler. I don't know. Jacob said it's a mother, mother muffler. I think it's a resonator. Who the fuck knows? But we're going to cut that bitch off, weld another pipe in there, and, you know, we have a cat back straight pipe. So we're going to do some runs down the road here. And uh, so if you just want to cut the muffler off, you know what it sounds like. And we're going to get her going. time I've ever heard this car outside the car through the video uh, and I realize now it doesn't sound like anything uh, inside the car it sounds pretty not race car -y, but a lot louder than what it sounded like in that video uh, real quick we're gonna do a review on this Harbor Freight Daytona 3 ton pretty much the best jacks in the game for the price uh, if you buy a snap on your faggot you can suck my uh, uh, not my nuts but my, my balls at Just, you know, look at how nice of a jack that is. It jacks the car up super easy, low profile, you know, in the future, I got some ST wheels for this thing, and uh, I'm going to be uh, lowering it about an inch and a half, you know, race car stuff, pretty cool. So yeah, this jack, badass, I suggest you buy one, best money in the world you ever spend. Alright, so if you're a complete idiot and don't know how to take off a muffler, my buddy Derek got it filming for me. He actually cut this pretty straight cut got a hanger there and a hanger there and the muffler i call it a suitcase muffler because it's big the car when it doesn't have a muffler, when it's got the muffler on it you literally can't hear anything but that's that uh just want to thank you all for all the likes and subscribers on the last video and views uh got so many i was able to hire my own cameraman All right, so a few welding tips here. Uh, what you want to do, make sure you put your hood on. If you got one of these flaps, don't put that down and just... So you just... That's welding tips with Mongo Garage. That looks pretty good, right? Craig. Craig working on a vehicle. He's undoing the positive terminal and the battery. Whenever you weld on a car, make sure you do that or you'll fry shit. Uh, this is power. This is four cylinders of power. There's a lot of room back there for a turbo, uh, but we're broke around here. That's why we're hacking this exhaust. Uh, some tech tips when you're welding on exhaust, especially old one, never clean it. MIG welders really rely on clean metal, so you don't want to clean it. Um, it just makes your welds look way better than they need to be. 
And for a hack job, if you really want to do it right, you don't want your welds to look good. You want them to look like shit. Um, so yeah. Uh, I'm actually going to try to weld this thing all the way out so I don't have a nasty exhaust exhaust leak that, you know, be exhaust leaking underneath my butthole, making it feel weird. So I'm going to burn her all the way out, try to at least. boys and girls oh have you started yes okay uh so i also bought this clamp this fits pretty nicely in there that one up there kind of fits like not nicely but i'm just gonna throw this on here tighten her down and uh and i'm gonna throw some tacks back there just for safety not really safety but you know whatever i'm gonna call it my buddy Jacob put some of these things on there and he said he's got a hell of an exhaust leak. So hopefully I don't have to get under here and weld it because it sucks. I used to, I know some of you guys are probably like, wow, this is haggard as shit, but I used to stick weld all my exhausts together and that was, I wish I still had that stick so you guys would love that atrocity. Stock exhaust to a three inch exhaust to a three and a half to a four inch to five inch to seven inch tip it was minty uh so that's that's all good we're gonna throw some tacks on here there is this little plate right here that goes back up into here throw that back on there some torx head bolts and uh we'll take her for a test rip after i somehow get it off these jack stands that might die so this might get uploaded first cold start here uh, it might it's probably cold so we'll see see what she sounds like was it worth it So guys, uh, the videos, you know, sometimes they'll be a little off and on. Uh, there's some bitching in the comments about it. Uh, you can lick my taint. 
But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm redoing my house, and uh, I, I got more important things to do than making YouTube videos, so you can kiss my ass. Oh, shit, you started, didn't you? Um, so, I'm just going to go over the Derby cars. I got the Buick here. Me and the buddies were out here hanging out one night, and some drunk son of a bitch actually stole this and ran over my mailbox. Hit my house, that's why the hood's all messed up. Uh, the radiator's busted, bent the core support. I mean, drunk West Virginia sons of bitches. This one, uh, my old boss, you know, he, he dealt with drugs. He let me have this old girl pretty cheap. Uh, like I said in the last video, this one really dicked me. Been out of work for seven months. But I quit my job to do YouTube, so. This one here, Santa Claus brought me this piece of shit. I guess the next son they got it from. Come on, come on in here, Craig. You see this wiring harness? He didn't just cut it, but it goes over here and the wire's just gone. I mean, he just... He just dicked this one, but it's got Michael Myers on the side. I had, you know, I think this one's just going to the scrap yard ain't worth the time. This old girl, you all recognize this one. This is what really blew me up on YouTube. Uh, so yeah, comment in the comment down below if you can. Somehow I made my last video for children. I don't want no goddamn kids watching my videos. So hopefully this one y'all can comment. Uh, but yeah, comment which one's your favorite. I, I'd say my favorite, uh, you know, this one's probably my favorite. It's a V6, gonna go to put some nice headers on it. Uh, so yeah. My buddy dance song, you don't listen to his videos, I wanna be like him, yeah, so you're a good dance girl. For the channel, we get 10,000 subscribers. I'll keep growing her. It's shit, but I'll keep growing her, man. I'm doing it for you guys. I love you. Like the video, share it. Do all that happy horse shit. I'll catch you next time.